Welcome, welcome everyone to the world of dark and light. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I'm having a pretty darn good one. So as you can see, there is all kinds of craziness going on around me. And we're working on the brand new base place. I've moved everybody over here. We've left that danger, danger zone over here. And uh, I even tried to block that meteorite drop. And apparently you can't. Like I built foundations all around it. And they just kept dropping on the foundations. But anyways. As you see, some things have changed. I'm looking awesome in some all kinds of crazy armor. And uh, I want y'all to know, like, some of these drops you get are awesome. Look at this leather tunic I got. Look at that. That is crazy. I'm going to have to repair it, huh? Anyways, armor is 75.4. Like, the traditional armor ain't nowhere near that high. But also made me up a fur cape, which I think looks absolutely awesome. Like, it is a massive improvement over the druidic one. I think it looks great. Uh... <laughs> also, I have made a discovery. <laughs> like, you gotta be very careful when you attack stuff on uh, your foundations because you can damage them quite easily. Like, it's really <laughs> easy to damage your base. But, uh, yeah, I got me another pig. It's the one we had sitting over there the other day. He is amazing, amazing. Like, I love him. He's nice. He's, he's dark. He's black. Yeah, look at him. He's all black. Like, he's black. He's awesome. But, uh, he's also still a fantastic harvester. And, uh, as y'all can see, I've put down what's called a framework. That's what all this sparkly stuff is. And I know this looks silly right here, but, uh, I'm afraid, since I got this big cliff and my animals are on neutral, I don't want them to go run off the cliff. Well, that's weird. Should have been a thing there, but apparently... Oh, okay, it's, it's entering a town. Uh, that's where the edge where I can build at. It's right here. Like, literally, it's a line that runs all the way across. But, uh... I put it down as originally just kind of planning out my base, but I kind of like it. It's really low durability, so things could destroy it real easy, but it's really cheap to make. So I thought, you know, I'm going to make my patio out of it. And I tried to make my doors out of it, but apparently you cannot place a framework door inside of a wooden frame. And my intentions is once we build the house, is I may try to do the ceilings out of it just to add, you know, a little magical pizzazz. Because <laughs> look at this crazy stuff. And, uh, yes, this is a ton of magic went into this stuff. But at the same time, I've been leveling, leveling up my, uh, what is it called? Uh, that skills, let's see. Yeah, right here. Thermology? Thermology? Whatever this is called. This is what makes you do your magic stuff and calls your potions and everything. And uh, it takes forever to level. Like, it's the one item I have discovered that's taken longer to level than anything else. And the reason I've been trying to level it is, is is this. The Magic Altar. Now, this bad boy is pretty expensive, but it is essential for what we need. And the reason I need it is this stuff right here, which I didn't even realize when I have to level up again. Oh my god. <laughs> I've harvested so many trees, like y'all don't even know. But uh, we need this. We need this so that we can progress. This is the next big thing in making Iron Hooks. Uh, iron hook arrows to tame the bigger creatures but uh what's crazy you know is like this was very covered in trees like i don't know if y'all remember but i have harvested all these trees except for the big ones i'm leaving those big trees i like the way they look kind of like the scenery with them and i'm leaving these right here to block kind of the city off but uh i've harvested all of these trees down through here all the way over and there's a little village over here as well like you can see over here, which uh, we may put an emergency stash of stuff in because it can't be destroyed. But so far, I've spent hours and hours over here, and there's not been nothing that bad. So I'm pretty happy with this location. Goblins seems to be about it, and they only seem to spawn on the other side of this little town right here. But I've harvested all of these trees. And uh, it's really strange. It's like right here, these have not respawned one time since I harvested them the very first time. And that's been... <laughs> Good grief, I'd say at least five or six hours ago. And, uh, plus server time. But, uh, all down through here, these are all have come back three or four times. Like, I've re I've harvested these multiple times. Hmm, that's really weird. I wonder why those haven't respawned. I wonder if that is an arc bug that's been brought over to this game. Hmm. But anyways, I've already crafted up a whole bunch of resources to build on the house. And I've got a whole bunch of crap in my inventories we need to get rid of. So we're going to sort some of this out a little bit. And uh, I've been kind of trying to get myself where I'm a little bit more organized. And, uh, oh yeah, I have found out a way to level writing quick. 
right here you see these things right here it says deer rings if you come over here and look in writing it actually says gather hide craft rings tame creatures now i thought it meant saddles but no once you get to rank three you can craft the uh, no wait is it rank two one of these yeah here it is rank rank two okay yeah right right there you can craft deer rings and oh my goodness you all like check this out like watch i'll craft one real quick okay now we're going to craft one and i'm going to back out while it's crafting Watch down here in the corner of my riding skills as it goes up in level. Like it will climb multiple points on the uh, percentage bar. Now, see 91%? Now watch. Let, watch I'll cast, make another one. And uh, let's see, what do I need? I need uh, hide. We've got tons of that somewhere here. Also, my chest box don't, like won't load in. It's really strange. I don't know what's up with that. But, uh, alright, yeah, we're at 91%. What, what else do I need? Oh, I need fur. Brr. Let's go to the, the fur machine over here. Come here, fur machine. Give me your fur. Alright. Rain. Let's craft another one. Now, let's get back up here so we can do our thing. Now, watch at the corner down underneath the supply of the vendors. Which, thank goodness they fixed. There's a patch coming to fix it. But if you watch here in a second, we will go up. Look at that. 99%. So I picked up 8% on one craft. Now, granted, these, I have no use for these things because I have not even seen a deer. But uh, if you want to level up your riding quick, that is definitely the way to go, you all. Like, no joke. Like, I have tamed and only taming high creatures like that Longhorn have done anything to my riding skills nearly as much. But uh, let's get some of this junk out of our inventory. We want to do some building. That's what we got planned. We want to build, build, build. And, uh, stack. Do you not stack? Oh well. Let's take the small stack out then. Uh, let's put our twine in there. Uh, now to stack. There we go. That's what we wanted right there. Now I've taken this stuff out to save some weight on my toolbar, which I think will actually take this out of the crafting box. And we'll put it over on the other one because... Hmm. This one right here has got my uh, soul gems and stuff in it for the moment, but it's also got my saddles I've been saving. So we'll go ahead and put these over here. And we'll put my bow and stuff over here as well. Since I don't need that, we'll put my arrows in here. Alright. And we'll keep throwing knives in case something bad goes down. That way we got something that deals damage on us besides our fireball. Alright, so let's go. Like I said, I've already crafted up a whole bunch. I don't think I have enough. Um, this stuff's expensive, like. And it's funny because I'm getting ready to move from woodworking stone working which you have to be a level 35 and I'm a level 34 so it's kind of funny just as I'm finishing my base I'm going to be able to upgrade and look one more and I can make the dino gate or the beast gate my bad <laughs> but uh I've been doing some experimenting just a tiny tiny bit and uh I'm under the impression that we want to put down our stations first and the reason is, is if you've ever built in the other game arc you know that there's a way that... I really hate how that turns sideways. There's kind of a cheaty way so you can put stuff down and then uh, put your walls down so that it's closer to your wall and it's not so far away from it. And this way, you know, you save space. And I think we're going to put this over here. I do believe this is where we want this stuff. And you know what? This is difficult. Like, I can't... Is there a way? Isn't there a way to hide? Hold on, let me see. No, okay, that does not work. There's supposed to be a way to hide your HUD, but apparently it don't work. Oh, there we go! Fantastic. That is amazing. <laughs> now let's go third person. <laughs> and switch my weapons as I scroll out. All right. Let's get this just up to the wall as close as possible without being, you know, like completely bored. Uh, right here. Fantastic! 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 Sorry, hit my microphone. <laughs> apologies, apologies. Alright, so, got that down. Now, I think I want to put my forges... I believe I want to put forges over here, because I kind of want to keep my workbenches together. But at the same time, I have to make sure I leave room. 
Actually, no. Let's put the forges right here. Yeah, that works. We'll put them over here in this corner. That way they're near the workbenches. And boom. Got our first forge. I need to make another one, but this is just to get it started. All right. Oh, wow. It's really hard to, like, figure out what you're looking at. Uh, Let's see. Windows, walls. We'll do those next because, you know, those are aesthetic. And let's see. Let's put one there. Let's put one, yeah, okay, one there, and, hmm, one there, and one there. Oh, that one put in the wrong way. I hate that. That's so annoying. Oh, well, it's okay. We have another one. I think we have another one, right? I fell through the floor. Ah, I'm in the floor. All right, so what happened is it probably placed on the outside. Hmm. I hope that's on the right foundation and not on the outside foundation. <laughs> Everything else plays perfectly fine. I did have some issues with this door. It didn't want to place right either, which is really weird. Because you can see there's like logs on the outside. And I'm trying to keep that on the outside like an actual log cabin. Alright, there we go. So we got our windows. Now we just need to make some windows put in them. But that's okay. I ain't that worried about that. Now we got to put down our walls. Can I carry all this? I can. Oh. So, wall. Uh... See, it's trying to do it again here, ain't it? You have to be careful this side. This side's wanting to place funny. And you're wondering how I switched that. I hit E. Just like another game we know. <laughs> Fantastic. Hmm. I can't tell which way that one's placing. I think that's right. Okay, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. We're so good at this. It's weird that these are all trying to place wrong. And two. I said seven. Now that one figured out. That one worked perfectly fine. That's the one side that's been giving me all the issues. <laughs> and there we go. We've got walls all the way around. Yay! Let's see how many walls we got left. And I'm doing that by hitting delete. I don't know if I changed that key or not. That's how I removed the HUD, though. Um, let's see. I have 18 walls left. All right. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do is... uh. I don't know, y'all. I don't know if I want to, like... I honestly, I'm a little conflicted on how to do this. I, I don't want to design just a box, you know? And what I'm thinking is either... Let's hop on our board real quick. I think he can carry us. Oh, yeah. He's overweight, but he's still fast. Yeehaw! We'll run over here real quick, and we'll look at these houses, and I'll give you an idea of what I'm trying to go for. And I, I'm not trying to emulate this completely, but I'm trying to, you know... Like, you see how these have the points... I'm thinking either about doing that or kind of staging the point off to the side a little bit. And uh, kind of like, okay, like, let's see. Yeah, okay, y'all know how those are. They have the point like that. Kind of building that, then putting like either A, having the point go all the way up just like that, and then building like an upstairs or putting the point like right here. And having it come down like this and like that. And then having this be like a second floor. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Can I walk this thing through the door? Ugh. Yes, I can. Fantastic. Oh, he does not like the wood. He does not like these wood floors at all. He does perfectly fine on the foundation. Can we jump through the window? Let's find out. Oh, we can crouch through it. Oh, burglar. Burglar. Gonna need windows, y'all. All right. <laughs> so, hmm. Let's see. Hmm, so conflicted. I really don't know what to do. I, I don't... I guess no matter what, I want to make it too tall. Pretty much, the, basically no matter what. Because without being too tall, our heads touch the ceiling. And that's just, that's annoying. So let's go too tall. Sadly, but shortly, we got to do it. I don't know if we're going to have enough to go all the way around. We should... Uh, we should... Hmm. I think we may replace some of those with windows so that the light can get through. I think that is definitely something we're going to do because it's going to be dark up in here. And also check this out, y'all. I have a new meat. Like I've learned how to make spiced meat, which is cooked meat and blueberries. And it's supposed to last longer than regular meat, but I'm not entirely sure. I think it's very negligible. It's like maybe a minute. But uh, you make it 
by putting cooked meat in the fire and a whole bunch of blueberries. And right here is the recipe for it. See, it's five blueberries and one meat, which is really awesome. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I kind of don't know if it's really worth the effort, even though if you got a dino or not a, uh, oops, a creature that harvests, then yeah, you're perfectly fine. Like this dude right here, look at this insanity. Mushrooms and blueberries for days. <laughs> like, we got them for days. I really hate that that scroll changes our weapon. That needs to be disabled in the worst way. But, uh, let's see. Alright, so, we've got down our main primary wall. So now, the question is, is how do we want to do the upstairs? Because I need an upstairs. I'm going, I want an upstairs. I, I want to have, like, a platform where I can land a flyer on this. And then come in from the roof. So I think what I'm going to do is we're going to use this side as our upstairs. And that way, this is going to be like our landing pad over here. So let's go back over here. And let's grab this. I'm going to need two more of each one of those. I didn't even think about the fact that it's going to take two of each. Uh, let's see. Let's go here. Do I have everything I need to make them? I don't even see them. What are they called? They are called... No, that is not what they're called. They're not called gables. Uh, I'm going to need something. I'm sorry to tell. Hmm. I don't see them. Do y'all see them? I don't see them. Uh, I need to make a cooking pot. Okay, there we go. Triangle. Triangle. Alright, so that's the cheapies. We want this one. What do we lack? We are lacking wood. We got tons of that. Wood. Doot, 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 doot. Uh, triangle, simple wall. Triangle, simple wall. Fantastic. Oh, so heavy, so heavy. I'm out of water in my, bo my bottle. I am out of water in my bottle. We're going to have to go get some water. All right, so let's use this. Which way is this one going to go? This one's going to go on this side. Oh look, it's got a window hole in it. That's kind of annoying. But oh well, that's nice. It'll light in. It'll let it light in. Oh, I'm so excited. We're doing it. We're actually getting a base place set up. And then I'm going to have to convert it to stone. <laughs> Which I think what I'll do is I may just like replace the, the, the bottom floor with stone. I don't know. We'll figure out something. We'll make it look good. But there we go. That looks really nice. What does it look like out God. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Oh, look, y'all. I don't like that one bit. You see that gap? Look at that. Ooh. Ooh, that's horrible. Why is it like that? It's not even lined up. Ooh. Why would you do that to me? That's really weird. I wonder why it done that. Did it do it out back? It looks like it did. Huh. Well, that's annoying. Anyways. <laughs> back into here. Let's get rid of these walls. We don't need these no more. Uh, sloped roofs. Looks like I'm going to need one more sloped roof. Well, isn't that annoying as well? Uh, can I put this? All right, no. Uh, uh, there we go. Uh oh. Awesome! 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 Come on now. Oh, this is amazing. We're actually getting progress. Boom! Now, do I want to take it all the way up? Do we want to go full point? I mean, if we go full point, that means we can put a ceiling here along this, and then there'll be a walkable space up there. But how would I go full point? I don't think there's a actual... Is there actually a... I don't think there's actually like a steeple point or whatever you want to call it. Simple triangle ceiling. A triangle ceiling. Now that's a ceiling. We want a basically a roof piece. Is there a triangle roof piece? I mean, I don't think there is, y'all. Like, I'm pretty sure there's not. Hmm. At least not that I've unlocked. Let's look at our skills. Uh, let's see. Are we in building? St woodwork, okay, yes, okay, so spike walls, barrier oh, that'd be handy barrier, no, it does not look like there is a triangle roof piece 
Well, okay, so we go flat. That's cool. Well, even now we know. Did I make any ceilings? I don't think I made any ceilings, did I? Uh, I made a compost bin. Um, no, I did not. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Uh, okay, yes. Well, let me play with this real quick. This is something else we want to do. I want to get into the gardening. And uh, I have no idea how this is working. I'm assuming it's just going to work like the other game. But, uh, you know, we really don't know. I mean, that's... Let's get our light out. Come here, fairy. I call upon you to make light for me. What is that? Oh, it's just a two-headed vulture. All right, so let's see. Intake. How do you intake? Do you intake well? Let's just, just jump it off. Hmm, where do I want my guard, Daniel? I can't build here. Ooh, conundrum. Well, I guess we could destroy that rock and put it, like, right here. Yeah, I like that. We could put it right here. I like that. I like that. I like that. All right, let's just jump straight off here. Uh, there's a... Uh-oh. Okay, shoot. Thought we were stuck there for a minute. So we got water intake here. We got water intake here, though. All right, so that's kind of cheating. But oh well. That's fine. I don't care. I am not above the cheaty right now. So, boom! Yeah! Look, it's made out of bamboo. Cool! I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Uh, what am I doing over here? Okay, now we want... Um... Does not appear we can place that there. It is obstructed. Interesting enough, we can build this inside of the city zone. Yeah, make that interesting. Alright, back around. Woo! Wait, water. Water, no. Water. Yeah, okay. We got a full water bottle with full and thirst. Let's do this. Alright, now can we put down the straight one or we're going to have to make another? I wonder if there's an incline. I didn't even notice there was an incline. Alrighty. This one? Nope, 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 nope. Oh, you big dummy. Alright, so we're going to have to make... Let's find out if there's an incline once we get back up here. Now, I don't know anything about the water or the... What are these called? Irrigation? I know nothing about the gardening in this yet. Uh, I'm assuming this is an incline. Yeah, okay. So we're going to need... Oh, look, we can make... Let's make a couple of those, too. Um, a couple more of the straights. We're out of whatever we need to make them. That's okay. That's okay. I don't care. Too bad we can't pick these up so I can put this incline at the base. But that's all right. It is what it is. Awesome. We need to clear this area out. Give me your resources to level my magical skills that I need to level up in the absolute worst way, and it takes forever to level up. Can y'all see that? How slow that is? That is stupid. Like. <laughs> All right, let's harvest all these little harvestables. This is, by the way, is one of the best ways to level right here. This and just punching, like straight out, like you just you level up all kinds of stuff when you do this. And oddly enough, you seem to level up decor a lot as well, which is really weird. But anyway, can I harvest that? Is that just extra craft left over? I don't know. All right, so I'm going to put one of these here so that we can actually play with it and see how it works. Does it have an inventory? It does have an inventory. That means we can put water bottles in it. Uh, uh, no. Check it out. Oh, I kind of wish it was pointing the other way, but whatever. Just drink from it. Drink. Yeah, washing my head. Let's get the head washed. Yeah. Do, do, do. Cool enough. Okay. That's cool. I like it. I dig it. I dig it. I dig it. I dig it. All right. So, now the question is, do I want it to go straight more, or do I want to bring it straight out this way? Let's bring it on out to the side. Uh, hmm, I could have probably done that over there. And that would keep this nice and neat. Hmm. Oh, well, let's just go ahead and place it there. I'm not that picky. It can be undone. It's cheap. And last one. Boom! We're going to have to make another incline. But there we go. We got, we got our 
water set up, I probably could actually bring that on over to the base, couldn't I? And have water tap inside. I mean, that would almost come straight in the window. It's not lined up. Oh my god, I just noticed it's not straight. Oh, well, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Anyways, let's see, do we have anything else? We have to put down the compost bin. We'll get the compost bin put down. And... Boom! This has got to go outside, because, you know, it's the compost bin, it stinks. You got some poop in it and some straw, and you don't want it inside because it could cause a fire. And does it have to be on a foundation? It does have to be on a foundation. Hmm. So you know what? I'm not going to put that down. Actually, we are not going to do that. But what we are going to do is I want to experiment real quick. And uh, this is getting close to having to wrap her up, but uh, I want to experiment real. Hmm. I'm sorry, I had a thought. Anyways, I want to experiment real quick. Let's bring this tab up with this. Let's see if we can make... Um, oh, we can. It's an amazing magical ceiling. <laughs> so we can use this the magic ceiling on top of the house. Oh, uh, I'm, 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 I'm not gonna lie, I'm tempted to make my ceiling all magical, but I kind of like the, kind of, has that got glass in it? It does got glass in it. I'm kind of digging the wood roof, though. Hmm. We might replace it, I don't know. I just wanted to experiment to see if we could place stuff there, since I wasn't able to put the door down. But, uh, I do need to make some ceilings. And let's, ceilings... Uh, shabby. What do we got here? What do we need? What do we need? We need wood. We always need wood. You've probably got tons of wood on you. You should. Or did I already take it all up? Nope, you do. Haha. <laughs> Ceilings. And let's make what? I need... I need four at least. Alrighty, alrighty, alright. Do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. No, we don't want that there. We're on the wrong toolbar. We want that there. Seven. All right, now here is the big question: Do we want it going this way, or do we want it going this way? Which, okay, discovery made, y'all. See how the ceiling's pointing this way? The reason it's pointing this way is because I'm facing this way. If I take it away from it and come and face this way, ninety percent of the time it will face this way. It is something I have been fighting with, like it's one of them things. But uh, yeah. Anyways, I. Th I think I think we're going to go crosswise with it, and that way it's offset with the floor, and it kind of gives us a little bit more texture. You know? Let's see. Now that it's all lined up, and ta da! We have got our base going. Let's build a ladder. Ladder. Wait, what? Skylight? Hmm. No, 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 no. The ladder. We want a ladder. Let's build. Uh, who is? Dun, 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 dun. So excited, get the base place done. Man, that's a huge ladder. Aha! And there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh my goodness, y'all. I really want this to have a point. Like, I'm really sad that I can't put a point up here. Maybe I'm missing something. If I'm missing something and y'all know I can put a point on there, let me know. Because, I mean... I could leave it open, I guess. I don't know. Hmm. I'm really conflicted on that. I really kind of dig this this blue, though. Like, we could have this be kind of all magical up here. All right. So there's one last thing I want to try to make, and I don't know if we're going to be able to make it before we go, and that is this right here. And I should have everything I need. I might be just a tad bit. Yeah, I'm gonna need more spark powder. We also probably need more bones. And this thing, what this does is this is your resurrecting stone. Like this is, oh wow, I don't even know what that is. What is that? Alright, so I guess I'm not going to be able to make this right now. Uh, oh well, we tried. We'll have to see what that is. I think that might be bone powder. And I, I have some, but I'm not quite sure where it's at. I believe it's on this guy. But we have come up on our time, y'all. And I hate to do it, but we are going to have to go. Because, you know, we got to keep it down. And, uh, let's see. Real quick, we'll look. Oh, look, more cores. 
Um, yep, I guess I don't have any. Could have sworn I had some bone meal. Weird. Oh, I need to make a mortar and pestle. Well, that's okay. But I hate to do it, but we are going to have to wrap her up here. We got our base done. There's just a few more cosmetic things that I'm going to keep doing. And uh, we're going to get it finished up. But if you enjoyed this episode, smack that thumbs up button. I appreciate it, dude. It helps me out a whole bunch. Like, y'all really don't know. It means a whole lot. Comment below. Let me know what you thought. If you got any questions, suggestions, or tips. Anything you want to see. If you just want to say hi. Whatever. You know, you feel completely free. And subscribe if you haven't already. Share this if you would so others can find it easier. It helps them out. helps me out. And it's an amazing thing to do. And remember, you all. Stay safe, have fun, and game on. I'm going to need something. I can already tell. Hmm. I don't see them. Do y'all see them? I don't see them. Uh, I need to make a cooking pot. Okay, there we go. Triangle. Triangle. Alright, so that's the cheapies. We want this one. What do we lack? We are lacking... What? We got tons of that. Doot, 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 doot. Uh, triangle, simple wall. Triangle, simple wall. Fantastic. Oh, so heavy, so heavy. I'm out of water in my, bo my bottle. I am out of water in my bottle. We're going to have to go get some water. All right, so let's use this. Which way is this one going to go? This one's going to go on this side. Oh, look, it's got a window hole in it. That's kind of annoying. But oh well, it's nice. It'll light in. It'll let it light in. Oh, I'm so excited. We're doing it. We're actually getting a base place set up. And then I'm going to have to convert it to stone. <laughs> Which I think what I'll do is I may just like replace the, the the bottom floor with stone. I don't know. We'll figure out something. We'll make it look good. But there we go. That looks really nice. What does it look like? Oh, God. I dig it. I dig it a lot. Oh, look, y'all. I don't like that one bit. You see that gap? Look at that. Ooh. Ooh, that's horrible. Why is it like that? It's not even lined up. Ooh. Why would you do that to me? That's really weird. I wonder why it done that. Did it do it out back? It looks like it did. Huh. Well, that's annoying. Anyways. <laughs> back into here. Let's get rid of these walls. We don't need these no more. Uh, slope roofs. Looks like I'm going to need one more slope roof. Well, isn't that annoying as well? Uh... Can I put this? All right, no. There we go. Uh oh. Awesome! 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 Come on now. Oh, this is amazing. We're actually getting progress. Boom! Now, do I want to take it all the way up? Do we want to go full point? I mean, if we go full point, that means we can put a ceiling here along this, and then there'll be a walkable space up there. But how would I go full point? I don't think there's a actual... Is there actually a... I don't think there's actually, like, a steeple point, or whatever you want to call it. Simple triangle ceiling... A triangle ceiling. Now that's a ceiling. We want a basically a roof piece. Is there a triangle roof? Yeah, I'm under the impression that we want to put down our stations first. And the reason is, if you've ever built in the other game, Ark, you know that there's a way that I really hate how that turns sideways. There's kind of a cheaty way so you can put stuff down and then uh, put your walls down so that it's closer to your wall. And it's not so far away from it. And this way, you know, you save space. And I think we're going to put this over here. I do believe this is where we want this stuff. And you know what? This is difficult. Like, I can't. Is there a way? Isn't there a way to hide? Hold on. Let me see. No. Okay. That does not work. There's supposed to be a way to hide your HUD, but apparently it don't work. Oh, there we go. Fantastic. That is amazing. <laughs> now let's go third person. <laughs> and switch my weapons as I scroll out. Alright. 
Let's get this just up to the wall as close as possible without being, you know, like, completely borked. Uh, right here. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. Sorry, hit my microphone. <laughs> apologies, apologies. Alright, so, got that down. Now, I think I want to put my forges... I believe I want to put forges over here, because I kind of want to keep my workbenches together. But at the same time, I have to make sure I leave room. Actually, no, let's put the forges right here. Yeah, that works. We'll put them over here in this corner. That way they're near the workbenches. And boom. Got our first forge. I need to make another one, but this is just to get it started. All right. Oh, wow. It's really hard to, like, figure out what you're looking at. Uh, Let's see. Windows, walls, we'll do those next. Because, you know, those are aesthetic. And let's see. Let's put one there. Let's put one, yeah, okay, one there, and, hmm, one there, and one there. Oh, that one put in the wrong way. I hate that. That's so annoying. Oh, well, it's okay. We have another one. I think we have another one, right? I fell through the floor. Ah, I'm in the floor. All right, so what happened is it probably placed on the outside. Hmm. I hope that's on the right foundation and not on the outside foundation. <laughs> Everything else plays perfectly fine. I did have some issues with this door. It didn't want to place right either, which is really weird. Because you can see there's like logs on the outside. And I'm trying to keep that on the outside like an actual log cabin. Alright, there we go. So we got our windows. Now we just need to make some windows put in them. But that's okay. I ain't that worried about that. Now we got to put down our walls. Can I carry all this? I can. <laughs> I'm having a pretty darn good one. So as you can see... There is all kinds of craziness going on around me. And we're working on the brand new base place. I've moved everybody over here. We've left that danger, danger zone over here. And uh, I even tried to block that meteorite drop. And apparently you can't. Like, I built foundations all around it. And they just kept dropping on the foundations. But anyways, as you see, some things have changed. I'm looking awesome in some all kinds of crazy armor. And uh, I want y'all to know, like, some of these drops you get are awesome. Look at this leather tunic I got. Look at that. That is crazy. I'm going to have to repair it, huh? Anyways, armor is 75.4. Like, the traditional armor ain't nowhere near that high. But also made me up a fur cape, which I think looks absolutely awesome. Like, it is a massive improvement over the druidic one. I think it looks great. Uh, <laughs> also, I have made a discovery. <laughs> like, you got to be very careful when you attack stuff on... Uh, your foundations because you can damage them quite easily like it's really <laughs> easy to damage your base but uh yeah i got me another pig it's the one we had sitting over there the other day he is amazing amazing like i love him he's nice he's, he's dark he's black yeah look at him he's all black like, he's black he's awesome but uh he's also still a fantastic harvester and uh as y'all can see i've put down <laughs> what's called the framework that's what all this sparkly stuff is and i know this looks silly right here but uh, i'm afraid since i got this big cliff and my animals are on neutral i don't want them to go run off the cliff well that's weird should have been a thing there but apparently oh okay it's the center of town uh that's where the edge where i can build at is right here like literally it's a line that runs all the way across but uh i put it down and originally just kind of planning out my base but i kind of like it it's really low durability, so things could destroy it real easy, but it's really cheap to make. So I thought, you know, I'm going to make my patio out of it. And I tried to make my doors out of it, but apparently you cannot place a framework door inside of a wooden frame. And my intentions is once we build the house, is I may try to do the ceilings out of it just to add, you know, a little magical pizzazz. Because <laughs> look at this crazy stuff. And uh, yes, this is a ton of magic went into this stuff but at the same time i've been leveling leveling up my uh what is it called uh that skills let's see yeah right here pharmacy thermology whatever this is called this is what makes you do your magic stuff and calls your potions and everything and I, it takes forever to level like it's the one item i have discovered that's taking longer to level than anything else and the reason i've been trying to level it is is, is this the magic altar now this bad boy is pretty expensive but it is essential 
for what we need. And the reason I need it is this stuff right here, which I didn't even realize when I have to level a framework door inside of a wooden frame. And my intentions is once we build the house, is I may try to do the ceilings out of it just to add, you know, a little magical pizzazz. Because <laughs> look at this crazy stuff. And, uh, yes, this is a ton of magic went into this stuff. But at the same time, I've been leveling, leveling up my, uh, what is it called? Uh, the skills. Let's see. Yeah, right here. Thermology? Thermology? Whatever this is called. This is what makes you do your magic stuff and calls your potions and everything. And I, it takes forever to level. Like, it's the one item I have discovered that's taking longer to level than anything else. And the reason I've been trying to level it is, is, is this. The magic altar. Now, this bad boy is pretty expensive, but it is essential for what we need. And the reason I need it is this stuff right here, which I didn't even realize when I have to level up again. Oh my god. <laughs> I've harvested so many trees, like y'all don't even know. But uh, we need this. We need this so that we can progress. This is the next big thing in making iron hooks. Uh, iron hook arrows to tame the bigger creatures. But uh, what's crazy, you know, is like this was very covered in trees. Like I don't know if y'all remember, but I have harvested all these trees except for the big ones. I'm leaving those big trees. I like the way they look. Kind of like the scenery with them. And I'm leaving these right here to block kind of the city off. But uh, I've harvested all all of these trees down through here all the way over and there's a little village over here as well like you can see over here which uh we may put an emergency stash of stuff in because it can't be destroyed but so far i've spent hours and hours over here and there's not been nothing that bad so i'm pretty happy with this location goblins seems to be about it and they only seem to spawn on the side of this little town right here but i've harvested all of these trees and uh it's really strange it's like right here these have not respawned one time since I harvested them the very first time. And that's been, good grief, I'd say at least five or six hours ago. And uh, plus server time. But uh, all down through here, these are all have come back three or four times. Like I've, re I've harvested these multiple times. Hmm, that's really weird. I wonder why those haven't respawned. I wonder if that is an arc bug that's been brought over to this game. Hmm. But anyways, I've already crafted up a whole bunch of resources to build on the house and I've got a whole bunch of crap in my inventories we need to get rid of so we're going to sort some of this out a little bit and uh, I've been kinda trying to get myself where I'm a little bit more organized and uh, oh yeah I have found out a way to level writing quick right here you see these things right here it says deer rings if you come over here and look in writing it actually says gather hide craft rings tame creatures now I thought it meant our windows now we just need to make some windows put in them but that's okay i ain't that worried about that now we got to put down our walls can i carry all this i can uh -huh. so wall uh see it's trying to do it again here ain't it we have to be careful this side this side is wanting to place funny and you're wondering how i switched that i hit e just like another game we know <laughs> fantastic hmm can't tell which way that one's placing. I think that's right. Okay, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. We're so good at this. It's weird that these are all trying to place wrong. And two. I said seven. Now yeah, that one's figured out. That one worked perfectly fine. That's the one side that's been giving me all the issues. <laughs> and there we go. We've got walls all the way around. Yay! Let's see how many walls we got left. And I'm doing that by hitting delete. I don't know if I changed that key or not. That's how I removed the HUD, though. Um, let's see. I have 18 walls left. All right, so I'm thinking what I'm going to do is... Uh, I don't know, y'all. I, I don't know if I want to, like... I, honestly, I'm a little conflicted on how to do this. I, I, I don't want to design just a box, you know? And what I'm thinking is either... Let's hop on our board real quick. I think he can carry us. Oh yeah, he's overweight, but he's still fast. Yeehaw! We'll run over here real quick and we'll look at these houses and I'll give you an idea of what I'm trying to go for. And I, I'm not trying to emulate this completely, but I'm trying to, you know... Like, you see how these have the points? I'm thinking either about doing that or kind of staging the point off to the side a little bit. And uh, kind of like, okay, 
Like, let's see. Yeah, okay. Y'all know how those are. They had that point like that. Kind of building that, then putting, like, either A, having the point go all the way up just like that, and then building, like, an upstairs, or putting the point, like, right here, and having it come down like this and like that, and then having this be, like, a second floor. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Can I walk this thing through the door? Ugh. Yes, I can. Fantastic. Oh, he does not like the wood. He does not like these wood floors at all. He does perfectly fine on the foundation. Can we jump through the window? Let's find out. Oh, we can crouch through it. Oh, burglar. Burglar. Gonna need windows, y'all. Alright. <laughs> so, hmm. Let's see. Hmm. So conflicted. I really don't know what to do. I, I don't... I guess no matter what, I want to make it too tall. Pretty much, the, basically no matter what, because... Without being too tall, our heads touch the ceiling, and that's just, that's annoying. So let's go too tall, sadly, but a bunch of resources to build on the house. And I've got a whole bunch of crap in my inventories we need to get rid of. So we're going to sort some of this out a little bit. And uh, I've been kind of trying to get myself where I'm a little bit more organized. And, uh, oh yeah, I have found out a way to level writing quick. Right here, you see these things right here? It says deer rings. If you come over here and look in writing, it actually says, Gather hide, craft reins, tame creatures. Now, I thought it meant saddles. But no, once you get to rank 3, you can craft the... Uh, no, wait, is it rank 2? One of these... Yeah, here it is, rank rank 2. Okay, yeah, right, right there. You can craft deer reins. And oh my goodness, you all, like... Check this out. Like, watch. I'll craft one real quick. Okay. Now. We're going to craft one, and I'm going to back out while it's crafting. Watch down here in the corner of my riding skills as it goes up in level. Like, it will climb multiple points on the uh, percentage bar. Now, see 91%? Now, watch. Let's watch. I'll cast. make another one. And, uh, let's see. What do I need? I need... Uh, hide. We got tons of that somewhere here. Also, my chest box don't, like won't load in. It's really strange. I don't know what's up with that. But uh, all right, yeah, we we're at ninety-one percent. What? What else do I need? Oh, I need fur. Brr. Let's go to the the fur machine over here. Come here, fur machine. Give me your fur. All right, rain. Let's craft another one now. Let's get back up here so we can do our thing. Now, watch at the corner down underneath the supply of the vendors. Which, thank goodness they fixed. There's a patch coming to fix it. But if you watch here in a second, we will go up. Look at that, 99%. So I picked up 8% on one craft. Now, granted, these, I have no use for these things. Because I have not even seen a deer. But uh, if you want to level up your riding quick, that is definitely the way to go, you all. Like, no joke. Like, I have tamed and only taming high creatures like... That Longhorn have done anything to my writing skills nearly as much. But, uh, let's get some of this junk out of our inventory. We want to do some building. That's what we got planned. We want to build, build, build. And, uh, stack. Do you not stack? Oh, well. Let's take the small stack out. Then. Uh, let's put our twine in there. Uh, now to stack. There we go. That's what we wanted right there. Now, I've taken this stuff out to save some weight on my toolbar, which I think will actually take this out of the crafting box. And we'll put it over on the other one, because... Hmm. This one right here has got my uh, soul gems and stuff in it for the moment, but it's also got my saddles I've been saving. So we'll go ahead and originally just kind of planning out my base, but I kind of like it. It's really low durability, so things can destroy it real easy, but it's really cheap to make. So I thought, you know... I'm going to make my patio out of it. And I tried to make my doors out of it. But apparently you cannot place a framework door inside of a wooden frame. And my intentions is once we build the house, is I may try to do the ceilings out of it just to add, you know, a little magical pizzazz. Because <laughs> look at this crazy stuff. And, uh, yes, this is a ton of magic went into this stuff. But at the same time, I've been leveling, leveling up my, uh, what is it called, uh, and that skills, let's see. Yeah, right here. Thermology? Thermology? Whatever this is called. This is what makes you do your magic stuff and calls your potions and everything. And I, it takes forever to level. Like, it's the one item I have discovered that's taking longer to level than anything else. 
And the reason I've been trying to level it is is, is this. The Magic Altar. Now, this bad boy is pretty expensive, but it is essential for what we need. And the reason I need it is this stuff right here, which I didn't even realize when I have to level up again. Oh my god. <laughs> I've harvested so many trees, like y'all don't even know. But uh, we need this. We need this so that we can progress. This is the next big thing in making iron hooks. Uh, iron hook arrows to tame the bigger creatures. But uh, what's crazy you know, is like this was very covered in trees. Like I don't know if y'all remember. But I have harvested all these trees except for the big ones. I'm leaving those big trees. I like the way they look. Kind of like the scenery with them. And I'm leaving these right here to block kind of the city off. But uh, I've harvested all all of these trees down through here all the way over and there's a little village over here as well like you can see over here which uh we may put an emergency stash of stuff in because it can't be destroyed but so far i've spent hours and hours over here and there's not been nothing that bad so i'm pretty happy with this location goblins seems to be about it and they only seem to spawn on the side of this little town right here but i've harvested all of these trees and uh it's really strange it's like right here these have not respawned one time since I harvested them the very first time. And that's been, good grief, I'd say at least five or six hours ago. And uh, plus server time. But uh, all down through here, these are all have come back three or four times. Like I've, re I've harvested these multiple times. Hmm, that's really weird. I wonder why those haven't respawned. I wonder if that is an art bug that's been brought over to this game. Hmm. But anyways, I've already crafted up a whole bunch of resources to build on the house and I've got a whole bunch of crap in my inventories we need to get rid of so we're going to sort some of this out a little bit and uh, I've been kinda trying to get myself where I'm a little bit more organized and uh, oh yeah 